Hi guys. Today we are going to weave with some Malabrigo, one of my favorite, favorite yarn companies. Um, I've got a sock yarn today. It, it's starting to, it's starting to fall apart, so it doesn't look nice and neat and pretty, but actually you can see the colors better this way, so maybe it's a good thing. Oh, so pretty. This is not going to be so much a yarn review as it is going to be a, wow, look at how pretty this is because, you know, you don't need to review Malabrigo yarn. We all know it's going to be gorgeous. So, um, this colorway is 886 Diana. I, I think I will probably use something else in the warp because I don't know if this is strong enough for the warp. If anybody has woven with this in the warp, please let me know. Um, because I kind of would love to see how it looked in, you know, in both, in both directions, but I'm afraid. I just don't know. So yeah, let me know if you've woven with this in the warp, um, so that I can try it myself. Um, all right, let's get it on the loom and see what happens. guys. I, this is not a surprise. We knew this was going to be beautiful, but I mean, come on. I, you can't, you can't go wrong with Malabrigo. I put a, um, it's a DK weight solid in the warp. Um, it, it did uh, obviously make, you know, give the whole scarf a green, uh, color, but I mean, I, I'm not, I'm not upset with that. Uh, I did add a little bit of the war, the Malabrigo. Um, I don't know if you can see, but every third or fourth fringe, I added a little piece, a little double strand, just to make it pop a little bit. But anyway, not not a surprise. This is not the last Malabrigo I will be doing on this channel. I love them. I am not sponsored. I wish I was. I'm not. Um, I just love them. So anyway. Um, that's about it for today. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.